Hey there, this is uh, Gary Chambers with Tractor View, and I'm doing a little video walk around of my latest addition to my John Deere family, which I'm really excited about. Uh, it's a brand new 2010 uh, 2305 uh, John Deere utility tractor. And this is the first piece of John Deere equipment that I've ever bought new, so that's pretty exciting. And um, probably one of the only new pieces of equipment I could afford on our farm right now. So uh, pretty excited about it. Uh, 2305, got the bucket loader on it, the 200CX. Um, come over and we'll take a look at the instrument panel here. Uh, pretty great little 540 on it. You can see I've got all of three hours on it, which I did yesterday, rototilling a garden and doing some light work around the yard. Does have the uh, front wheel assist on it or four wheel drive should you need to lock it into diff lock. Uh, got the rototiller, works great, variable speed. Uh, put a few hours in with it yesterday. Really beefy PTO. Um, you know, it's a really solid built product. I priced out a lot of different products prior to buying this one. In fact, the Deere was one of the most competitive, uh, which was surprising. Um, obviously, John Deere has a good name, good resale value. And uh, so even if it had been a little more, of course, I would have gone with the Deere. But, uh, you know, money matters. And, and therefore, uh, pricing it between the Kubota and the Bobcat, uh, the Deere was priced right in the same market. So I was pretty impressed with that. It's a real comfortable unit. You can see the hydraulic quick offs. Uh, really cool feature on this, as my uh, dealer mentioned to me. These clip up. Um, you take the pressure off the bucket by setting it down. Uh, they clip up. It's a real quick release of your bucket. And then you just unhook your hydraulics, which are conveniently located in the, in the front corner here. Very cool. Real simple uh, instrument uh, use, too, and really user friendly after using it for a few hours. Um, Throttles conveniently located here, your uh, shifters, and um, this is your hydraulics and, you know, up, down, side, back for the bucket controls. Really simple to use. Um, a few of the other features, I mean, it's just a really comfortable uh, outfit to drive. Um, diesel engine in it. Very nice. Bucket got used a little bit yesterday, but not a whole bunch. Definitely not enough to wear any of the green paint off yet, so so that's good. Uh, this is an investment that, um, for me being on the farm, we're used to having big farm equipment around. Uh, we have a, a farm hand that we use. We have a you know small cultivator that we use behind one of our 160 horsepower tractors. But you know you rip your garden apart with it. You run it too deep. Um, you know a unit like this is is for light use around the farm, and uh, this machine is really a great piece of equipment to add to our. Uh, our deer lineup. Anyways, um, like I said, uh, great little piece of equipment. I think all told it was about, uh, I don't know, 17,500 or something like that Canadian. Uh, John Deere has some great programs. If you want zero credit, it, uh, uh, they have a program on three years for zero credit, which are zero percent interest, which is amazing. So anyways, I just wanted to give a little video preview that I highly endorse this, even though I only have three hours on it uh, as of yet. Uh, I will certainly be putting lots more hours on it. Um, in the not too distant future, probably after harvest, uh, which we are just finally starting to get into the field swathing. So anyways, my new John Deere toy, just wanted to show everybody, think it's a great product and I'm very pleased with the purchase. Talk with you later.